managing home server with all the Docker containers has never been easy. What if I tell you that there is a solution where you can manage all your Docker containers without ever writing a single Docker Compose file? How about an all-in-one app which can manage your data and acts as a NAS as well? Casa OS presents itself as a cloud operating system. Even though it calls itself an operating system, it's not really an operating system. It is just an application which makes managing your home labs extremely easy. In this video, we are going to take a detailed look at what Cos OS is and what features does it provide. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. Cos OS simplifies the different steps of managing your home server. A one-stop place to build and deploy your home server applications. You are in charge of your own data. With SOS, instead of using Google or Dropbox, you can put all your data on Nextcloud and sync it with all your devices without worrying about the big tech taking advantage of your personal data. Plus OS makes sure to take charge of all the complexity of setting up your self-hosted application. With just one click, you can install the app of your choice. You can either just use CasOS from your local network or if you want, you can set up a reverse proxy, a Cloudflare tunnel or a VPN of your choice to make it accessible remotely. One of the main reasons I personally like CasOS is how easy it is to build a NAS using your spare drives. You can mount any number of devices you want and use them as a file server for your backups or syncing your data in real time. CasOS is designed with great focus on support for low power devices. With this, you can be sure that the server isn't putting a dent in your wallet while enabling you to enjoy all your favorite services. Before we proceed, please click the subscribe button below to keep updated on the latest news regarding home labs and exciting new projects. When it comes to your personal data, it is necessary that you are sure that, that the data is not being handled maliciously. Plus OS keeps a strong focus on transparency and all of its source code is available on GitHub. This allows quick bug fixes and adds more scrutiny to the application. Cas OS provides top tier support for single board computers like Raspberry Pi, Intel Nox, and Zimbara boards. In this tutorial, we will see how to install it on the latest stable version of Debian. In order to install Cas OS, make sure that curl is installed on your system. Write the following command to install Cas OS. This script will install all the dependencies and run a web server with CasOS interface. As this step might take some time depending on your internet speed, I'm going to fast forward this. Once it's installed, you can go to the IP address shown at the end and it will take you to the CasOS interface. Once the application is installed, now let's take a look at the main interface for CasOS provides a very nice and clean interface to manage your server. It has a beautiful dashboards. On the left you see some widgets and on the main panel you can see an app store. You can use this to install any apps from the templates which are provided or with a custom docker compose if you want. You can monitor your system usage directly from this interface. Plus OS allows you to merge different drives to make just one system-wide storage. But be careful as Cos OS is currently in beta and it's not stable, so there is a risk associated with it. With this interface, you can even log into the machine via SSH directly from the web browser. Let's now take a look at the App Store. Cos OS provides plenty of template applications from its App Store. Click on the apps on the dashboard and you can access various templates for all the different categories. CasOS takes care of all the complexity related to the installation of the apps. Installing apps is literally just one click. You can customize apps later if you want or build your own using a template from the existing apps. 
you can either delete reset disable directly from this interface you don't have to open a docker terminal to stop or restart your containers another reason i like casos is its ability to act as a network attached storage you can access file system directly from this web interface which makes it extremely usable mounted volumes from docker containers are exposed for easy accessibility cas os also provides admin privileges to the file system so be careful about exposing your services insecurely through the internet otherwise someone can get access to your system if the app that you're looking for is not present in the templates you can create your own template extremely easily just use the name of the image that you want and pull it from docker hub along with all its defaults custom options also allow you to map ports mount volumes etc to the local system you can even manage the environments directly from the interface i have been using casos for running next cloud for my home server and so far it has been running smoothly casos is a very unique project which combines all the different features from different existing services even though it is only version 0.4 at the time of this video it still provides extremely useful features for setting up your home lab if you like this video click a thumbs up and let me know your favorite home lab application and as always don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next video